another aspect of crypto that is super important is uh, like what what Tether is doing. Um, like, mm -hmm. I, I mean, it's part of, it's part of the backbone of the entire of the entire crypto market. We just have to, you know, face that. And I, I like it. Um, yeah, I know that there's a lot of uh, concern and worry about Tether. But after all of these years, uh, you know, it, se it, it seems to be as solid as any other stable coin uh or fiat currency <laughs> so sure <laughs> um right. but they it's not the first time they've done this either remember they had omni and yeah right. they migrated off of omni yeah. and of course there's still transactions probably doing redemption with the omni right so i didn't even get to the part where uh what they're doing so they they, they, <laughs> Sorry. Uh, they that's okay they, they they they're not supporting eos and they're not supporting algorand anymore um, and it's the same thing as you just said, right? It's it's just lack of of, uh, of utility there, or you know maybe volume is the right word, uh, and people are using it in other places. Um, it's shocking to me, I, honestly, that because they use it on um, Tron. Uh, that's that's one of the, its biggest use cases. It's on massive Tron. now, yeah. Mm -hmm. And and Tron is a is a. It's not even, a, it's barely a fork, right? It's a copy of EOS. Um, and that's the part I'm just like, how did EOS lose this? <laughs> you lose that, 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 that use case. Um, so that was surprising to me. Um, but yeah, that, they, uh, so they stopped there. Yeah, that's, that's still interesting. I think, um, yeah, I read that the volume that they had, I think both, the whole, the whole volume um, on both of that was like less than 1.5% of the overall uh, USDT right. volume. So obviously for Tether, it was more work uh, than anything to totally. keep those things going. And a couple of months ago, they also uh, started to support uh, Tone, the Telegram, you know, the mm -hmm. Telegram blockchain token uh, network. I mean, that thing has been uh, gaining a lot of traction uh, since the beginning of the year. And, and yeah, it was added in a lot of places and it looks like now Tether has been supporting it for a couple months. And I think that they are uh, kind of uh, restructuring themselves and uh, making sure they don't waste resource where it's, it doesn't make sense. And then they focus on what actually has a uh, potential. Yeah, yeah, I mean, think about it. go ahead, sorry. I was just gonna say ETH has always been their go-to, right? I mean, that was their main tokenization after Omni, I think. I don't think there was anything in between. Um, I don't think ETH is going anywhere. I know that they're on other chains. I know that Tron is there because, of course, most people, as we could all state, that the fees are an issue on Ethereum. Uh, so Tron um, has sort of a, a much, <laughs> much lower uh, a cost of use than it would be in Ethereum. But um, yeah, it doesn't make sense to be on or in or participate in chains where your volume is nothing. Why Who's Why it? support those issues? And just think why? about the support, right? So on every exchange that that coin appears on, Correct. where it has paired with Tether, they have to support that. The, the Tether has to be worth a dollar, right? And so- Correct. I, and yeah, it's automated to a degree, but you know, you and I both know how often things just fail um, and they sure. can't fail. And so well, everything is redundant. And they have this. That's it's a ton of uh, resources oh, to, yeah. ma to maintain a, a, a yeah. pairs and keep tether worth a dollar the whole time. And they have uh, to rebalance, right? The more network yeah. they have, the more now they have to be active to make sure that liquidity is matching. Because otherwise, they would have many problems. They have to work with exchanges and all that. Yeah. And so, of course, supporting networks that are not as popular is it's not worth it for them right yeah, like, yeah. and so i mean it's definitely sense, not yeah. a good sign for eos and algorand like it's definitely not a good not. news for them but yeah, but yeah to me that's i mean to me if you've had it and you lose it that's it that is to me that's a pretty huge issue uh there are other coins right and i mean i guess as long as you're trading against bitcoin also that's good but uh it's that's a, that's a, that's a big pretty big blow i think yeah, I, um, I don't know if there is a cost. I don't know if um, Tether is asking any fee to do any of that. I don't know yeah. if, um, but at the end of the day, if um, 
if it is not a fee situation, but it's a tether decision, it's the opinion of tether, right? Tether mm -hmm. considered that um, <clears throat> maybe those two networks have less potential than um, the Telegram one. But I mean, it doesn't mean that it's the case. It's just Telegram. Yeah. Uh, it's just. But, but the other thing is that it's still you know, those coins or whatever can still trade against Tether. Uh, they just the Tether you have that you're trading against isn't. <laughs> you know, it's Ethereum Tether. It's not their Tether. Yeah.